Hello. Welcome to my walkthrough of God of War. Well, I'm sure not many of you watch my Last of Us 2 uh, playthrough, uh, let's play. So, I even I playing the game was feeling really burnt out after a while. But, yeah, I, I am really passionate about this one. As this is a project that I have always wanted to do. So, uh, I'll be covering God of War from start to finish, uh, hopefully doing it 100%. So this will be like a walkthrough style, uh, instead of like a blind let's play. Because I actually have already uh, gotten the platinum trophy for this. So I would like to make a guide for, you know, people who has just got into God of War, you know, or they don't know where certain things are, and I'm here to help. So, hope you guys enjoy. Let's begin. Now, first things first, uh, we're gonna run this game in normal mode, which is the balance. Uh, you know, people who can, who wants to go for give me a challenge or give me go to war, you're free to do so. But um, the strategies of uh, trying to deal with enemies is uh, mostly the same. So. You know, everyone can enjoy. Oh, I'm playing, uh, I'm playing this on the PC, by the way. So, uh, just in case anyone of you is curious. There's side, some side info for you guys. Get in the boat, boy. Because, um, for I think Still the want me to tie to the boat? opening and tutorial, there is actually not much freedom. Um, but there are some stuff that are uh, pretty much quite missable. Boy. First time, I mean, like, uh, you can always come back and, like, you know, way late in the game. I will guide you through everything they can get. Uh, at the early stages, uh, that is enough. Up until the the Lake of Nines open up, because I only have like uh, materials up to maybe three episodes, and then uh, Father? I'll do I'll what? do more to walk through. Did something change? As time goes on, the forest feels different. Yeah. Hopefully you enjoy, hopefully you guys enjoy this one as much as I enjoy making it. Yes, sir. Yeah. 
since this is like the opening and stuff, uh, I plan to make this uh, a bit longer so that at least we can reach the um, the open world, the you know where where more freedom of exploration begins to open up uh, at least for a little bit. So uh, a little bit earlier. So yeah, you guys can you know always. Uh, skip this part maybe if you guys have no idea uh, if you guys already know what you're into and stuff but you know stay stick around stick around cutscenes are pretty good story is pretty good I love it that was the last loud let me turn that down a little bit a pinch should be a lot better now also I hope my mic is not too loud as well She's ready. Well, 
Guess we're going hunting. What are we hunting? You are hunting deer. Hmm. Which way? In the direction of deer. Okay. Uh, this way. Now we begin the tutorial. Uh, hold on, let me get to my notes real quick. Okay. PC version actually has some pretty cool stuff. Alright, might as well use it. Okay. Father, why are we doing this now? I need to no. know you can survive for, the journey. For the first part, just we for the mountain? go Depends here on you. and you'll be Hunt. able to collect your first collectible. Now, the collectibles here. If you collect one set, as you can see on the top, uh, on the right corner there, you can see uh, rewards is uh, 350 XP, and that in the beginning of the game is huge. So, yeah, uh, you know, be sure to go, you know, be sure to collect all of it if you can for some easy XP, and also you can sell them as a set to the vendors, to the merchants, to you know. Get good money. What did uh, you find? You Tracks. typically get Not more deer, money out of a set I'll keep looking. instead of selling them one by one. And for this area, come here, grab this loot, and here there's something you interact with. Boy, you miss these. Huh? Close, but also not dear. See? Tips are too wide. Mountains up. Your mother taught you well. Yeah. Okay. Now, following this path, just follow the right path and go under the bridge. Here you see a first chest. Some money, hack silver, which is the currency over here. And if you follow this path, you can get the second part of your collectible. And I can see there are two of them. So in this first tutorial part, uh, you will be able to get four, all four of them. So you'll be able to complete one, yeah. uh, one set. They're two round. And you'll be, be able to board. get the, the full EXP, the 350 oh. EXP. Now what? Now we jump. Circle or B. This way, boy. Hop. Oh. Wait, deer tracks. They're fresh. This way. Okay, there's nothing else here. Just follow. And cut some. Ah! Found it! Slow down, boy. Alright. You, you are see. hunting deer, not chasing it. Yes, father. As you can see, there's one loot here. Let's follow this route to the right for chest. More money. Uh, over here, and to the right, there's some more money. And here is your first tutorial. We broke our bridge. <gasps> How are we gonna ass. get across? Step aside. So, D-pad right, flip, L2, R2. Wow. Go. Now, oh. there are two here. types of throw. So, if you... Oh, God. I can't aim it yet. Crap. Oh, yeah. Here. Here will be your first oh. ever... Uh, battle. What combat are you doing? Now it's guard is up. Only fire... Only fire when I tell you to fire. 
I'm sorry. Do not be sorry. Be better. Find it. <laughs> Find it. Kratos is mad. Alright, anyway, as I was rudely interrupted, this will be a combat tutorial up ahead. I'll basically teach you how to use your axe uh, in battle. Light attack, heavy attack. No! You are not ready! Stay back! freedom in terms of like battle uh, in God of War so after the combat tutorial don't go don't go ahead just yet turn around go past this and you can find yourself a loot shiny get yourself 500 hack silver now Draugr they've never come this close to our woods before keep moving next in this area uh, if you look up, you can see a hanging pot. There will be a lot of these in the open world. So uh, just aim at it, just throw your axe, and fall, and then get your, your, your money. And uh, we have different types of stones here. So we have health stone, we got rage stones, and then the rarer ones is the EXP stones, which grants you like. 25 EXP or something like that. Now, you're split in between three paths. The left one is going to be progression. The one up ahead is going to be uh, leading towards a Nornir chest. Uh, we'll get more into that later. And the right hand side one will lead you to some loot and two wolves that you need to fight. And also a uh, third piece of uh, your third piece of collectible. So over here, you can just basically run, get this one. Mind see the that, end boy. See that uh, log over there? Uh, on the right side of uh, Kratos' head. That's the place where we got like our loot just now. Before we cross the bridge. Before you need to toss your axe. Yeah, that's the place. Just to bring this place around, uh, you know. Bring it all together. Get loot. Climb up. Okay, head down here. Head down here, and then you will see a couple of hungry. This will be a third piece of collectible. I was just hungry. What? The wolves. They weren't mean. They were starving. I imagine they were. Okay, so one more piece to collect to complete the collection. Right, now we have a Even first no longer red use coffin. It, we can. Now the red coffin sometimes can contain hack silver. Sometimes it could contain like uh, crafting materials, so be sure to open them, you know, open all of them if you can. But in this guide, I will guide you all of it, so don't worry about, uh, you know, worrying about missing, missing a chest or something, don't worry, I will guide you to all of it. Alright, now you just head back to the intersection that you were at. 
we turn right here and then take this one. Now, Northern Chest has three seals. So you can see C, R, and N. So what you do is you have to find three seals and destroy them. Here. And then the third one is going to be here. So once the three seals are destroyed, you can get a special item. So what we get here is a Eden's apple, which uh, if you collect three of them, as it says on the screen, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna level up your health, your maximum health. So there are nine of those in total. So uh, I'll guide you to all nine of them. So by the end of the game, you will have maximum health, maximum rage. Alright, now we're all done here, we can move on to the temple portion. Up there! There we go. You in the old temple. My mom told me never to go in there. We do what we please, boy. No excuses. That's right, no excuses. Back now. Can you hit it from here? We should get closer. I went hunting with mother a bunch of times. All right. You never wanted to take me. Take notes of the stairs. Do I know. You see that? Uh, it was her wish. Chest on top of a. It was time. Head. We will get to that later. In a little bit. There's actually one hanging base here. Something's not open that gate. Pick up the loot, and then you turn around. Go here. Atreus, open this door. follow me. Sorry, I got distracted. Now, up ahead, there's gonna be three wolves and one dragger. Uh, this is gonna be a big boy dragger. So, just be careful. I found in most cases that uh, if you deal with them from, from range, they are not a problem at all. And the final piece of your artifact. Now you can, you can see 457 EXP. Now, first things first. Now that you have like 583 EXP, you can now level up uh, by purchasing your skills. So, first skill that I recommend is either this one. Hold uh, right trigger for the brutal cleef or this one, uh, your first ever combo. So I prefer this one. So I'm gonna go for this one. But you can choose whatever you like. There's also skills for like a close close range combat. And choose this one, but you won't be meeting enemies with shield until a little bit later on. So I wouldn't get it now. So, 
Now I'm gonna go. I'm gonna grab this skill. So one, two, three. And you're gonna have. You're gonna have your own combo. Now, three. Okay. Alright, moving on. Now we're in the temple proper. Chain. What you're gonna do is L2, and then throw your axe at it to freeze it. Now you can see another room open here up as well. So go ahead and this and get yourself some silver. I don't believe there's any hanging base here. Yeah. All right. So once you get in, just so... press triangle Y track your axe so it opens so the right part the right part is gonna be progression don't go there yet where are you going get your money I think he's this and way. your loot huh. alright climb up the chain alright so this will be your first time seeing this Slowly barrels. Fun. Alright. Let's throw your axes at those blue glow. Yeah. Barrels you can destroy as well. But there are like urns all around the place where if you destroy them, sometimes you might get like a health stone or a uh, hex stone. Uh, remember this? This chest? Yeah. This is the path where you went down with Atreus just now. Destroy this. Have your very first shrine. Boy, over here. Oh look, it's Skolanati, the giant wolves who chased the sun and moon. Where did they come from? How did they get up there? What's happening there at the end? They eat the sun and moon, and then everybody fights. Yep. This is a. So now there are 11 shrines in total in the world. So I think once you find them all, you get like a ton of EXP or something like that. Uh, I'm not sure, let me check. Labor is more than this. Yeah. So per shrine, you will get 100 EXP, and complete, you will get 6000 EXP. That's a lot of EXP for you. Alright, so now we just uh, follow Treyas and see where this goes. Spoiler, we found a deer. Father, look. Wait for my mark. Relax. Do not think of it as an animal. It is simply a target. Clear your mind. Feet solid. Steady yourself. Exhale and release. Okay. I got it. Let's follow the on screen commands. It's easy. It's. Your knife. No. Finish what you started. <sighs> I can't.
did it, boy. Good job. I... Boy, boy, look at me. We did it. You are not ready. What? Are you serious? Nope. I'm dead. I, I proved myself. How am I not ready? We are going home. I haven't been sick in a long time. I can do this. You are not ready. All right, Papa Head is progression back home. But please, please, whatever you do, do not forget your loot. I am. Do not speak again. Alright, now they've got loot. Let's go. Now, oh, also here, there are ten, 10 trolls around the world. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get you to all of them. Don't worry. Here you're gonna learn about the stun meter. Uh, let's look it up be below the health bar. So easiest way to inflict stun is to use bare hand, bare handed, where you know when you press the right on D-pad, 
you equip your uh, Leviathan Axe, if you press it again, it's just barehanded. So, what you want to do is uh, use Atreus. One. Or rip them apart. It's easier to fill up the health bar compared to, like, uh, let's say, using your axe. Here is a Odin's uh, secret chamber of Odin. Still can't so get the doors open, huh? You can't get it Quiet. open yet, but it, do interact with it so that uh, you put it on your map. Inside is a Valkyrie, and usually with the Valkyrie, there is a Odin's Raven hidden inside as well. But yeah, we'll get to it. See how this guy's uh, fire here? Because rip them out. Uh, when you rip them apart, usually what happens there's like a wave you can see on the ground just now. Like a ring of fire. If that spreads, like you can flick, you can flick like uh, a level damage to the enemies around it. That was the Reaver. The Reavers are resistant, resistant to your Leviathan Axe. And I told you not to speak. Because it's like uh, ice, and then Reavers are like cold. So, usually doesn't really work. It, it does work, but it only does like minimal amount of damage. But well, why would a fire troll burn Mother's Garden? And since when are drummers so close to the house? And what was that frozen thing that attacked us? I do not know. Now be silent. We are almost home. Alright, since we have reached home, uh... There is going to be a boss fight coming up, but I'm going to save that for the next part because for the next part, uh, after this, we are going to head uh, somewhat close to the Lake of the Nines. So, uh, thank you for watching and I hope you stay tuned for episode 2 because I am I'm pumped. Yeah, so I'll see you guys soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.